How are things going, viewers? Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment, continuing through this new year with some more GTA San Andreas walkthrough videos. This video is activated by CJ at the airstrip in Verdant Meadows, but it is not a Torino video. In fact, to close out the final airstrip missions, you get a mission from The Truth. And this is actually the mission that it can be frustrating and you might have to redo it a few times, but you get a really fun vehicle, let's just say. And that vehicle is somewhat important to your character CJ um, rounding up some things that I will deal with in future videos and it's actually a lot of fun and it's what made, made the game for me in a sense where I suddenly realized yeah this game has gone gone full bore and not really taking itself that seriously it's just about having some fun. So let's get on with the final or next to last uh, airstrip mission called Black Project. Hail, fellow, well met. Namaste. Peace, Carl. My brother. Hey, Truth, where you at? Just checking that you were no longer on government business. Where is he? How the fuck would I know, man? He like the devil. Hey, man, you okay? Everything is transient. Uh, whoa, man. Uh, I'm passing through life same as every man. Okay. Do you have any idea what you're doing for Torino? Nah, I seem to be on the need-to-know basis. Oh, no, man. Two lies don't cancel each other out. You know that. We pay them to lie to us. Is that what our founding fathers wanted? No more, friend. No more. We're not alone. Get off me, man. What's going on? Everything is going on. Don't you get it? There's a place, not even on the map. A train is about to leave. It can explain better than I ever can. Boy, this is going to blow your fucking mind. We got work to do. You better drive. I'll explain. The elegance does not even touch it. So the truth does know about CJ's involvement with Torino, hey, but true. he do has his own here? little go, go, mission go. for CJ hey, and up, drops him out in the middle of the desert in front of a military base and he wants CJ to invade the base and steal something from it and this is actually a mission where it is timed and can be you can get kind of caught up in it a little bit so I'm gonna let things play out and can then uh, speak some more Okay, you're thinking you got to get into the research lab before 5.30. It's uh, 21.30 to start the, game, start the mission. But you look at it, and it's like each minute is a second. So, yeah, you think, oh, man, I got nine hours. No problem. Well, uh, yeah, it's going to be a little quicker than you think when 5.30 comes up, and you don't want to get too involved in shooting the soldiers and this whole stealth stuff. I mean, you got to use stealth, but you kind of got to be quick about it. You 
be honest with you, the sneaky way and circle about to the control tower kind of sucks. And I'm doing it this way right now, but I want to say you would be better off trying to sneak up to the blast doors. And in the end, you're going to fail. It's very difficult to actually keep the blast doors open or get to the control tower and open them and then not have everything end up locked down. And I'm going to continue on through this mission. The other thing is you can now switch out the AK-47 for a more powerful rifle, the ones the soldiers are carrying. And you can get a lot of ammo real quick. And once you've taken down a lot of soldiers and you pick up their weapons, yeah, you can get a thousand rounds of ammo extremely quickly. Okay, I worked all this way to get CJ to the bunker, or control tower, to open the bunker. And now it's a cold blue, cold red intruder. Everything is locked down. And now CJ has to find an alternative route into the bunker, which is essentially shooting out the air duct cover and making sure he doesn't get shot up by uh, soldiers. And then getting into the base that way. Like I said, it's kind of impossible. You're better off shooting your way in or getting close and shooting your way in and getting into the vent. And work your way into the control bunker. You are no longer being timed, so you can take as much time as you need to work your way down to turn off the SAM missiles and fight the soldiers who are attacking you and trying to kill you, then work your way back to the Black Project. Um, it's just a firefight, and you want to try and keep CJ's body armor and health up. There are several areas where you can then as you make your way through this, where you can 
get CJ's health and armor back, and you want to go down this ramp and work your way down because this leads to the uh, control room for the SAM missiles. And once you take down the soldiers, and again, you got this M4 rifle that, yeah, you can just keep loading up and loading up armaments. This will lead to the um, Black Project, but you want to, again, your main objective is to uh, get to the control area and turn off the SAM missiles. This is the control room to turn off the SAM missiles. Yeah, shooting the doctors wasn't a good thing. And CJ is not that badly hurt. He just needs to find some new armor. Just jump over the wall here and run toward the area that will get you to the um, black project that Truth wants you to steal. And you'll have to fight your way through. Don't go down this way. Uh, you see the soldiers. What you want to do is go back around and go the furthest hallway because then you'll get all the soldiers. All the windows before they leave tonight. Okay, now that the guards and everyone are taken down, uh, I'm just going to grab the key and this ar body armor, and I'm not going to bother shooting that guy, but if he gets in my way and is annoying, I will. Now, into this black project, and you got to fight your way down the silo, in a sense, in order to get this project and you got to work your way down you got you know this m4 and you just kind of skulk your way down and take these guys down one by one and then you finally get to the black project <laughs> Well, the way is now clear and the Black Project is available. Turns out it's a jetpack. And now you got to bring the jetpack to the truth. And you just fly straight up and you use the joystick on the controller to control the direction of the jetpack. This is why turning off the SAM missiles is important. And what's really funny is. Once uh, CJ gets out of the military base, they really don't pursue him. And you don't just fly over to the um, abandoned airport. You have to fly to the truth. And I will fast forward through the flight because it's kind of slow and boring. Actually, where CJ meets the truth, 
It's at the same place CJ did the interdiction mission for Torino. Carl, dude, man! Hey, here you go. You better stash it somewhere fast. Far out, have a nice trip, dude! Hey, wait a- Ah, was it too much to ask to get a lift in the town? So the truth just abandons CJ in the middle of nowhere, and he doesn't pay him. At least Trino paid CJ for his work, and didn't abandon him in the middle of nowhere. Hey! Carl, it's me, the truth. We got a date with Destiny, man, in about five minutes. Where you at? At the old airplane graveyard you've been hanging around. So CJ has to return to the airplane graveyard and meet up with the truth again. Uh, you don't have to be pressured on this. Just get back to the airplane graveyard, put on some body armor, and save the uh, game so that your character heals up to 100%, and then you can meet the truth for the next mission. Um, it's not that bad, the next mission, but I'm not going to say anything. I'm Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you like videos of this type, don't forget to subscribe, because then it tells YouTube that this channel is worth monetizing, which I'm trying to do. And my goal is to get to 100 subscribers. and subscribing it costs nothing you just subscribe and you get me in your feed of videos on your home part of youtube and you don't have to watch them but if you like watching them watch them and smash the like button as always thanks for stopping by